So this is the inside of my shed and I've got some of this expandable foam. So I'm hoping to seal it a bit better for the winter. So I'm going to use it around the edges here. Uh, and I'm going to put it along that edge there, seal it up a lot better and make it a bit more waterproof for the winter. Now it's this uh, bond fill from Rapide I'm using and because I'm hypersensitive and it does say it can affect your skin or allergies, I've got a mask and I've also got some gloves. To be fair, that's gone on really well and I think it's worked really, really well. It's really filled up the gaps. It doesn't look the cleanest, I admit, at the moment, but you can cut it up and you can sand it or whatever when it's hardened. And across the top there, them holes, I've filled them in. Uh, and like, yeah. It's filled them really, really well. It's, it's, it's filled the gaps. So that bit there's a bit messy because the tube was running out by then. So I was using my finger as well just to sort of shove the last of it in. But I think that's going to make a big difference for the winter. It's easy to use. You have to use the can upside down and there's a little nozzle that screws onto the top. And this is like looking from outside. You can see how it's foamed up from the inside to outside and really filled them gaps. So. And hopefully my, uh, my shed now for my bike is that bit drier.